Hello everybody, this is Adam here and I am going to be crowding Alien Isolation on the Xbox One. I've got my little Xenomorph Funko Pop. I have the Alien Quadrilogy, uh, Anthology even, the Anthology on Blu-ray, and of course, Alien Isolation. So, let's get cracking. I am very much anticipating this game. I guess you could say my chest is bursting with anticipation for this game so let us get cracking okay start game uh, I don't want a head tracking on head tracking it gives you the option on this as well if you've got connect you can use your uh, head maybe head side to side to bob around corners you can also get it to detect noise levels so if you're talking like I will be doing everyone's gonna know where you are I'm not gonna have that on myself because well, like I just said, I'm going to be talking. So, medium difficulty. Let's go, let's go. So, I'm a big fan of the Alien games, uh, Alien films. I'm a big fan of the Alien films. Um, I've not played the previous game, the Colonial Marines, however. I've heard there was bad reviews. I had played the Alien vs. Predator game, but... That wasn't great. But this horror game, uh, I think the only horror game I played is uh, Silent Hill Homecoming. Uh, so hopefully this will be a lot better than that was. In association with 20th Century Fox. Final report of the commercial starship Nostromo. Third officer reporting. The other members of the crew. Lambert, Parker, Brett, Ash, and Captain Dallas are dead. Ooh. Cargo and ship destroyed. I should reach the frontier in about six weeks. She won't. With a little luck, the network will pick me up. This is Ripley, last survivor of the Nostromo, signing off. Oh, that's eerie. <laughs> it's very eerie. Okay. So, that speaking in was Sigourney Weaver who played Ellen Ripley. Ripley. Oh. Uh, Ellen Ripley is I'm this Ripley's mum. I work for the company. And that's Samuels who works for the company. It's about your mother. Ellen Ripley. We think we may have found her, Amanda. Oh, that's piqued her interest. A commercial vessel, the Anisadora has recovered what we believe to be the flight recorder unit of the Nostromo. Where? Zeta Reticula. What did it tell you? We don't know. The unit was taken to Sevastopol Station. It's proprietorial material, so the company wants it to be collected as soon as possible. Sevastopol's a supply depot in the region. It's a... Permanent freeport. I know facility. what it is. Oh, she knows. She knows what it is. Transit's arranged. There's a courier ship called the Torrens heading out that way in two days. We're going to travel out. We. Oui. Me and another exec. And you, if you're willing. Look, Ripley. When this job came across my Sorry, desk, I, need a drink. <laughs> I read the case history. I know why you're working in the region where she went missing. You're still looking, aren't you? I've been cleared to offer you a place on the Torrance if you want to come along. Maybe there'll be some closure for you. Well. 
So, I don't trust Samuels already. He seems a bit too... I don't know, I just don't trust him. And if you see the Alien films, I'm going to take it. He's probably an android. I bet he's an android. He's got... He, he, he's too... He was too just a... Uh, too calm there. I bet he's an android. Oh, got me knickers on. Let's sign it. These lovely little retro computers. If you play, if you watch Alien films, you'll you'll realise why it looks like it's set in the nineteen seventies. Because that's when the films were made. Uh, oh, objective: get dressed. Hmm. Uh, sumo. Oh, wait, it's a today. No. No. Okay. No, I'm just imagining things. Yeah, if you've seen the Alien films, I mean, this this just looks like the Nostromo. This this looks like the film from the original Alien. It's down to a T. Let's go this way. Okay, where are my clothes? Where are my clothes? Oh. Oh, okay. I'm having a shower right now. A bit personal. Da da da. La 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 la. Oh. What's that? Oh. I'll take all of that, thank you. What's this? Oh, I just turned stuff off. Okay, let's see. So there's me, Ripley. I've signed in. Uh, you got Samuels, who's the robot. Who? Villane, Connor, and Taylor. Let's go find out who they are. Oh, get dressed. There we go. Yep, I've got shoes on now, so I must be dressed. Mm. Well, the cupboard's full of stuff. I'm just going to take everything. I don't know if I've got like a limit on what I can take, but... Oh, save game. This oldie telephone box. Please wait. Access terminal. Let's go this way. No, let's not go this way. Let's go this way. Oh, I can make my head jitter if I press LB. That's weird. Just what I've always wanted to do. Anything down here? No. Nope. Let's go talk to this guy. Oh, Ripley. Samuels, did you wake up early? Well, I don't really need as much sleep as the rest of I was just inspecting the Torrens facilities. A well maintained Yeah, what's your life? I realize it's a very similar model to the Nostromo. Yes. Oh, all oh, right. right. A later pattern, but close in spec. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. Is Taylor up yet? She's not a seasoned traveler. Hypersleep may have been punishing. <laughs> Haven't seen her. I'll go check on her. Now, see, just then, that whole, I don't sleep much. Yeah, he's a robot. He's got to be a robot. I don't trust him. Call me a paranoid woman, but I don't trust him. Not on my ship. It's down here. It's a bit cold. Mm -hmm. Nope, not this way. Oh, who's this woman? Taylor, 
Good oh, morning. That's Taylor. Ripley, it's certainly not good. I very much doubt it's morning either. That's a good point. How do you know what time of day it is? I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You get used to it. The radio. Very often. Drown out the wider. Those execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Waylon Yutani felt the need to send legal at all. Well, the the Nostromo and its cargo cost the company a lot of money. It's important we Ooh. find out what happened. If I can close the case with a conclusive accident report, it'll look great with my superiors. I'm sorry. That was insensitive. I realize your mother has been missing for 15 years and you... It's okay. We'll both get what we want, right? Uh, have you seen Samuels? He's probably been up for hours. What's she looking at there? I'm not, I'm not there. I'm here. His glasses aren't very good. All personnel to the bridge. Approaching Sebastopol Station. Looks like we're up. Okie dokie. Oh, there we go. Who's this? Who are you? Okay, just ignore me then. Huh? Over here. Ooh, shiny. Hope you all had a restful journey. The Torrance is in very good order for an old M class captain. She was a wreck when I bought her. Took a few years and a lot of contracts to refit. She pays for herself now. You said we're approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we docking? I believe your contact is Marshal Waits, is that right? Oh, I remember that room. That's in the film. Him. Good. Let's get this done. Don't worry, Miss Taylor. Routine. In and out. Connor, how are we doing? SMG loaded and calibrated. Approach vector locked. Right, so Connor's that guy settled there. Channel open, Captain. Does everyone have their briefing documents? You can watch the approach on the monitors. Oh. Oh. So that's our little ship, the Torrens, and that's that, we see whatever it? that place is called. Switch to monitors. Can we see it? Sevastopol Station. Is that damage? It looks like damage. Punch up 74, tight angle. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. I can't bring the Torrens into that. This is the commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV7760, calling Sebastopol Traffic Control. We're carrying three passengers on a whale and Yutani Bond. You're holding the Nostromo Flight Recorder Unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers portside over. This is Waits, Colonial Marshal, Sebastopol State, in a serious situation. Hello, Marshal? Marshal, this is the Torrent. Say again. The station's comm seem pretty screwed up, so I fitted Samuel's suit with a radio booster. I can only keep the Torrents in transit for 24 hours. You'll have heard from us by then. Safe trip. Stand by. My contract doesn't cover bloody spacewalks. It's the only option. And it's perfectly safe if you do what I tell you. Depressurizing. Oh, fuck. Hating this. Just shadow me, Taylor. You too, Samuels. Affirmative. Fuck happened here? My God, Ripley. You're doing good, Tim. <laughs> Just keep moving! <laughs> Samuels! Taylor! 
Respond! Anybody! Okay, so I'm back. Just have to like, cut a scene then. It's a little, uh, little chaos then. He, he, that, see, Samuels, he remained well too calm then. Oh, hold on. He didn't seem bothered at all. And then you've got Taylor screaming her head off. There's a little contrast between the characters. He has no emotion. She's screaming her head off. And Ripley's, well, just... Well, just everything like her mummy's in the films. Bit cocky, bit, you know, not scared of much. Right, okay, I've got changed. I'm back in my boots. Let's have a look. Where we are. Use registration points to manually save your progress. They will warn you if enemies are nearby. No, not enemies. I was really hoping there'd just be one enemy. It'd be an alien that I'd run away from. Not more enemies. I think that's saved. Okay, let's have a look what's over here. All oh, right, that's not good. Oh. <laughs> I think it just goes around the same way. Let's go over this way. Right, where do I need to go? Oh, Jesus! <laughs> okay. Uh... Oh. Oh great, let's go get in a vent. Because that's a good idea. <laughs> this way? So there's that flame. Let's go this way. Oh, what's this? Bonding agent. Oh, more of that stuff I collected before. Let's see what this terminal says. Oh, corrupted, corrupted, decommissioning. So, boys and girls, you probably heard about the whispers derp -derp -derp, of the Sevastopol. There we go, that's the name of the ship. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Okay. Let's get carry on. Rickety bridge, rickety bridge. 
Run! Oh shit. Nope. Oh dear. Oh no. <laughs> Am I alive? God damn. What's this? Flare. That's what I've always wanted. Oh, something. Down here. Is it? What's in this? Ooh. Ooh, goodies. I like goodies. Right, so this isn't the right way. There we go. Let's go this way. Some, some, moon. Sumong? That doesn't even make that's not even English. You always know working Joe. Okay. Keep moving. Okay. The scrap is lying around. Turn off the radio station. Oh, I hope this doesn't get too scary. <laughs> Hello? I'm not one for horror. Really, not one for horror. Not really the best idea to pick a game that's been described as the scariest game of the year. But, what am I going to do? Oh, we've updated a bit. Right. Where? Right. Oh, right. Oh, right. Well, that's done something. Personal, shared utility, kill the power. Harris, Turner, get back here now. We have a track somewhere in engineering. Lock the terminal down, kill the power, and don't forget your reports. Make them thorough. We're going to need our paperwork to be still power. When this ship's over. Wait, so. So they've killed the power for a reason, but I'm just doing the complete opposite of that. Let's see if there's anything over here. Oh, shit, there's people! There's people! You see that then? There's people. They ran from this direction. What the hell? No, oh, that's empty. It was pointless. You just saw people then. I'm sure I saw people tomorrow. So, so I'm not alone. Oh, let's not run into the electric wire. <laughs> it's ricketing. What the hell happened here? Good question. What the hell happened here? Let's go up here. 
That way, at least I could, if anything's down there, I can kind of peer over and shit myself from above. Oh, it's my ship. Come here. Hello? I'm here, look. Hi. Oh, goody. The shutters are coming down. I guess somebody doesn't want me to get out. Oh, <laughs> now the power's gone out. Oh, power box. Oh! <laughs> Something's in there! Something in there? Hello? Hello? Oh, that's an old. Nothing to collect over here. No. Oh, what's this? Another flare. I'm gonna save all these. With Andy. Let's go back up there a second. Down this way. Are they in here yet? No. Ion torch. I've got one of them. Wonder if you go back and it gives you stuff at a later time or something, maybe. That's a lie. Okay. Nope. Nothing. Nothing at all. That was a wasted journey. You really gotta look round for stuff in this. Uh, right, so something definitely knocked into that a minute ago.
Oh god. <laughs> no. I'm actually, I'm actually, I can feel myself like crouching over. I don't want something to jump out at me. Really don't want anything to jump out at me. is falling apart. Oh, what's that in there? Oh, no, yeah, oh, there we go. Keep trying to slide like you can in Call of Duty and stuff. It's not. Keep like running and go. Oh, oh shit! Oh my god! <laughs> oh dear! That was a person again, wasn't it? No! Please don't kill me. I only want to be your friend. Anything? Anything around here? No. Uh, that's a flashing light. That's a power box. Where's the magazine? Anything in there? Can I get in there? No, I need a jack. That's, that's great. Anybody got a jack? Bit of a weird place to sleep. Plasma torch. Are you just asking me for things I haven't got? Right, let's go this way. Oh shit, what's this? Score on the show. Oh! Oh shit, a dead body. <laughs> oh dear. What's, I need an iron torch. Let's have a look at him a sec. It doesn't look like anything to burst out of him. I can only hope that means the alien isn't here. Point I can stop shitting myself so much. Oh, <laughs> oh, my heart just went then. Jeez Louise. Hey, what's that? Oh, right, I'm stepping on dead bodies. Right. That explains a lot. <laughs> What a floor was squishy. Squish, 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 squish. squish. Fuck the marshals. Looters will pay. 
Oh, shaft's still in the loads. What's gonna happen to me? Hold to hide. Where am I hiding from? Well, the fact that there's something there to hide from means something is possibly going to make me need to hide soon. Maybe? Possibly? Blood on that table. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna save here and we'll call it quits for part one. Um, yeah, so that can be the end of part one and then um, join us for part two. And I will investigate the bloody table and the reason why there's something for me to hide in. Hopefully, there'll be a lot more of me screaming and a little less me walking around. Join us for part two.